Um, at the moment, I am actually uh, just hanging around about 200 feet up in the air, um, getting ready to change out an antenna on a translator because we're changing the frequency. Uh, we're actually going to be changing this uh, two-bay antenna right here um, to a, uh, a one-bay antenna and uh, changing the frequency too. So uh, I just wanted to introduce myself and uh, say hi, um, give you guys a bird's eye view of kind of what we do in the uh, engineering department and uh, different areas when we're building sites or working on towers. Um, so kind of look around for a sec. This is uh, Texarkana is where I'm at right now and uh, this is it. We could look through the tower. This tower actually is a lot higher than where I'm working, but uh, it's a beautiful day. This is uh, something I really enjoy doing. Right here, we're not working with a lot of weight, so we don't need a, a huge pulley or anything or a cable line, just a regular rope. Um, each bay is going to go down. I, right now, I already have it rigged to this bay here, and I'm going to get ready to, I already took out one bolt. I'm going to loosen it, take it down to the other bay, and I'm going to drop both of the bays at the same time, and then we'll bring up the other bay and put it into place. Uh, but uh, everything's looking good. Um, there's the ground. We are now uh, on this antenna right here, just one bay, and uh, so therefore we need to go and uh, change the, the frequency. Uh, that is down in the transmitter before we could turn it on and uh, do a few minor adjustments down below. But uh, pretty much the work on the tower is done. Uh, once again, I just had my pulley up there, and uh, there's my antenna right there. And uh, it is a good day, um, perfect day to climb. But uh, once again, there's the view I get to see, having a good old time. I love my job. It's uh, different every day, um, and so that's one thing uh, why I went into radio engineering is because it's a uh, different environment, different places, see a lot of different sites, um, a lot of different problems, and uh, I get to be outside, uh, which I enjoy doing. It's a beautiful day. Well, once again, it's a beautiful day. Man, yesterday was a terrible day, man. It was uh, about 30 mile per hour winds up here. Um, like I, like you might see, I have a runny nose. Uh, when it gets too cold, it uh, gives you a snot pop. But uh, today is uh, December the 10th. Um, that's some, the other day, yesterday, there was some storms coming through and it cleared out and it just got more windy so I couldn't work. Um, right now I'm uh, up to about 200 feet. Um, going to be working on some beacons and uh, going to uh, mount a, uh, a TV antenna up here so we could uh, receive some digital TV for uh, the uh, emergency broadcast system, the EAS system. So that's it. But uh, I just want to let you know I'm in uh, Hoxie, uh, Arkansas. And uh, I think what Hoxie means is uh, the middle of nowhere. Um, and so, uh, But it's a beautiful day. Um, let me give you guys a, a visual of what's going on. Um, basically, I'm in farm country, and so here you go. You know, Hoxie's supposed to be out that way somewhere, but uh, it's nice. Um, this tower goes up to about 400 feet, which uh, is not, uh, not too high. But a uh, beautiful day. You can see some water. All the water's frozen. It's about 30 degrees outside right now. Um, and as you can tell with the camera, there's not much wind at all. Highway out there. You know, uh, here's some old style beacons right there. And uh, those need to be changed out. I'll be putting new beacons on the tower. Some uh, static cats. Uh, that's supposed to keep the light and away from the tower. I don't know how well they work, but but yeah. Once again I do. I I enjoy this work. It's uh it's a very freeing job. Um it can get uh terrible when uh 
it's cold, but uh, even 30 degrees and no wind, um, I'd rather be doing this than uh, sitting in an office somewhere and uh, or stuck in a garage. So I uh, love to be outside. Uh, once again, just a great day to get out and, and have some fun. So uh, have a good